So this is silver chloride from depopulating the boards. I will refine this in another video. All right, so this is my waste gold solution. And here's some boards that I want the components off. So I want to strip them, but I don't want to do all the work. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these and I'm going to just throw them in the old solution. And it's going to depopulate and it's going to clean up the chips too. So all I'm going to do is just whatever I want and just throw it in the bucket. So I like these hard drive. I like the, I like the chips and the pins. So I'm just going to throw them in the bucket and let the acid do the work for me. Uh, I don't want things like this that have too much metal on them because it's going to, it's going to eat up the, the solution. But this is perfect. It's a little bit of gold and it's going to depopulate the chips. All right. Couple more of these hard drive boards and some more junk. It's also going to get any gold plating removed and oh, don't let it splash. Okay, see, so it's going to get all of these chips off. See, this is a perfect board. There's gold plating, there's lots of little chips. And I'm just going to let the acid do the job for me instead of having to depopulate all of this junk. And this is already waste acid anyway, so who cares if it uses it up or anything like that. Again, this has too much metal on it, so I'm not going to put these in there. So what I might do with these things that are left is I may take off the metal and then throw it in the acid. But look, this is a pretty good amount. This is doing the work for me. Now I'm just going to let it sit in the sun and do the work. All right, it's been a week or so. Here's my solution. It absorbs some copper, so it's green. Um, so hopefully it worked. So let me um, filter this. So what I'm going to do is I got another bucket here, and I got this, and I'm just going to pour it through this screen and see if we got any loose components. All right. Here's like some black powder. Looks like some stuff came out of the solution. Whether that's precious metals or or not, who knows? Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna have to look at this a little bit better. Alright, let's poke it. Okay. So there are some stuff coming off. Um, this solution was not the greatest solution. It was probably pretty watery. But yeah, if you look at the bottom, there's actually quite a bit of stuff down there. So it did do its job. You can see some MLCCs and some chips. So it did okay, but this wasn't the strongest solution. Um, it was probably pretty watery, so it could have worked better, but I could do it again if I want. I think what I'm going to do is just rinse this and then uh, maybe try it again. Alright, so here's the components that I got. I did get a bunch of chips, and it did clean off quite a bit of MLCCs. There's, I think there's a quite a bit of silver and maybe even gold in these buckets, so I'm gonna filter it. Here's the boards. I'm gonna actually run them again and get the rest of the stuff. All right, let's try this again. So I'm just gonna throw it in the bucket, and then I got a couple more boards that I'm gonna throw in here. They have, uh, some of them have a lot of metal, but it's not gonna matter now because uh, this is clean hydrochloric acid that I'm going to use, and so it's not going to puke out any stuff on them. This will again do two things. This will depopulate the boards, and it will uh, get them prepared for 
as for you know uh, the next step and probably remove a lot of precious metals too. all right we got this I'm just gonna pour in that exact amount yeah looks good and now we're just gonna leave it for a little while I think it'll work better if I cover it up too so we're gonna do that all right it's been about an hour and you can see here that a lot of the stuff is depopulated already so the the new solution is actually working really well so I'm just gonna shake it around a little bit and this should be done probably tomorrow all right I can tell that this works a lot better there's a, a lot of a lot of components that are in the bottom already that have come off you see there's a piece of metal down there and there's a chip there and so it's prepared it's worked a lot better um, oh see that just came off oh yeah definitely uh, working a lot better now that I'm using a good solution instead of just some regular used solution so um, I'm gonna let this finish but it's pretty much done you can see there's a chip right here um, so um, I'm just gonna let this finish and then everything will be ready to for the next step